Shadow. Welcome to Shadow of Judgment. This is for the week of August 2nd to August 9th. Great, great. What is Shadow of Judgment for any of you who are new? This is where I look at the nooks, the crannies, the things in the subconscious, the things in the background, the shadow sides of you and those who are going on around you. We already did you, air signs. Back up. You calm down. <laughs> what sign are we looking at next? God, did error. I already did you, y'all. Calm down. Okay. Earth signs. There we go. Three of pentacles reverse is yours. Either something not working, relationships at work, blah, blah, blah. Might even leave careers or decide you want to work from home because you can't stand people or I don't know. Anything you come up with. Earth signs. Vir Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Check your charts. If it resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. It's just a card game. Taurus, you're up first. Also, if you want a personal reading, my email, Facebook, Instagram is in the description box below. First reading is free of charge, of course. Everything else comes with a price. Not too much of a price, though. I don't charge that much for blood. Just kidding. I don't. I really don't charge for blood. I, I honestly don't want your blood. Like that's yours. You keep it. Cause that'd be creepy if you started sending me that. Like, ew. All right, Taurus. So far, y'all got Queen of Swords, Five of Cups, Five of Wands. I feel like y'all have no idea what you're doing. There's Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here. Most likely Libra. There's a lot of bickering between people. I feel like you don't know how to get about a new cycle that's very grounded. Or whatever. Because you're too busy being heartbroken about how things have gone down. And all this fighting is probably escalating more and more. Like you just want to heal your heart. But you're just not sure how to start a new cycle or get away without any sort of hindrance. Maybe you're hoping that in a new cycle, uh, air sign might apologize for their behavior. Um, but you're not going to wait and get old to find out with the Queen of Wands. King of Pentacles. Mm. Debts? Someone asking for debts to be paid? King of Pentacles? Like, I like saying that's him sometimes. Hmm. Weird. It's almost like you, you like um. Oh, there's a hermit. There's Tauruses or Virgo. Whoever I'm trying to say today, but all your signs are up in the board. And here we got the Justice card, Libra's card again. So I think you're weighing the scales on somebody who I think owes you something. Cross watchers, you could switch this around if you need to. Like, no concern, you know. Sw like, ro rotate where you need, right? But I'm talking to Taurus for a second, just because that's the person I'm talking to. Taurus, like, either you're illogical or you're dealing with an air sign who's being, like, way too in their. Not. Did I say air or earth? It doesn't matter. I probably said earth, knowing me. But it's an air sign who might be, um. kerfluffled. When it comes to a cycle and trying to almost get away with stuff. But it's like, you can see it. And it's like, hey, where do you think you're going? I'm coming with this conflict to you if I got to. Yeah, I think feelings are hurt here. That's on your mind. But you're trying to keep your chin up because, you know, this is justice all the way around. What is it that you see with the hermit card? Um, bad idea, not resurrecting something, not wanting to try another experiment again. Ooh, you got three. Um, things aren't moving forward with this, and it's time to let some shit go. At a crossroads. Hmm. Taurus, you have an interesting week ahead of you, but that was your shadow. Stop. 
That was kind of confusing. I don't know. The radio, the computer just stopped playing the radio for a second. But it didn't switch, so I don't know. Anyway. Virgo, your shot is up. Step right on the plate, motherfuckers. I'm totally not going to remember anybody's cards by the time I upload these. Ooh, okay. We got a few. Knight of Cups. Six of Swords. Three of Pentacles upright for you. With the King of Wands. We got water. We got fire. A little bit of air. A little bit of earth. We got the world. Someone wants to restart a site. What if, someone wants to start a, basically a clean slate. Stick around and try something new. Um, someone might be holding out at work too. Restricting themselves when it comes to it. Like, someone's looking over this shit like a king, but they approach like a knight. Or, not even a knight, a page. Very impulsively. Not without a lot of, um... Just w it passionately want to travel. Just want to go. I feel like this person would feel like there were also regrets if they were to, um, just stick around, too. Think that they could restrict themselves to like fighting a losing battle, nor an intuition. Okay. Virgo, I don't know what you're doing, but I feel like you're hesitating. Cross watch your switch if you need to, but I feel like you're really hesitating with speaking your mind or just it, it, like it, putting out what it is you're trying to plan with uh, grace. I'll say. I feel like it's something about grace. It's like. You love it, but when you look over shit, it's like, fuck. But when, when you approach, it's like, fuck, I, I'm, I'm kind of chicken it out a little bit. And then it feels like you're fighting for nothing, right? Now, you are at where you are trying to build with people, but it's like you feel like you're also being restricted as well. That's probably why you're coming up with the page. And it feels like, well, maybe if I restrict myself, I can think clearly. But even when you think clearly, it isn't helping you with this. It's like you're ignoring your intuition. Um, I feel like you want to stick around for a new cycle because I feel like you'd regret it more than anything. That's part of ignoring your intuition. I think that you would not feel good about doing this so much because it's just like that one cup's just stopping you. Like, hey, hold on. Do you really want to leave this or, you know, mm. what is it you're ignoring with the high priestess? Eight of wands almost popped out, but is it? Mm. Secrets. Pisces or Cancer, and Cancer's already up on the, well, Water Sign's already up on the board, and knowing about, the, and the knowledge, what? Hmm. Strange. Like, are you dealing with, a, like, a Water Sign who's, uh, approaches you and leaves you feeling kind of flustered? Because that could be it, too. It could be a water sign who comes with love, but they're really trying to figure out how to control everything, but then they come up as a page pretending shit. Like, they don't know anything. Like, almost innocent. And it's like you're ignoring your intuition about, like, what they're really doing. But you know. So it's kind of like, are you doing the whole I don't know what fair is thing again? I'm just calling you out for that just for a second. That's all. Because um, that could be the scenario, too. Like, you might regret somebody sticking around for a new cycle, too. Like, if you're holding out for things to work out with you and another person. It's a third card. Mm. Do you feel like you can't do it without them? Or something? Or you need them? Or they help you provide? You know, because technically, King of Pentacles, that's the second time he's come up reverse, like, Usually he's somebody who, um, when he's reversed, he usually feels like he's owed something or someone should provide for him, even though he's the one in the provider position. And I feel like that's kind of the case. Don't mean to knock you, but, like, that's what it seems like. It's like... Almost like you're holding out for somebody who you already know has bad intentions, but it's like you don't care because you want the coin, you want the money, you want the resources. 
Which I don't blame you for at all. That's the main purpose for your cause. Don't get me wrong. Like, business is business. Personal is personal. But, you know, if there's something that you know that might screw you in the ass later, be careful, man. Because, like, that could easily happen. Because this person's looking back at past situations, but they're coming up with a different kind of front. Capricorns! It's time for your shadow, my dears. Let's see what's going on with you for this week. Let's see what is popping up with Capricorn. You got Ace of Wands. Brand new beginning. The ignition is in. Wait. The, the, yeah, the key's in the ignition. So, drive the car. And you're ready to move on to things that'll bring you joy. Whatever you're walking away from, those cups are empty. And you need a break. You need a break. You need to rest. Um, this new start will help avoid a tower. You guys get the tower almost every time now. And it's like, well, actually, no. I saw a video. I'm going to put it up in the community post of um, this woman explaining what's going on with Capricorns. Apparently, we're going through a final descent or some shit before everything gets lighter again. Um, this is a decision that needs to be made. Or has been made, I feel like. Um, but you're kind of an idiot right now, probably. Or you could be dealing with another earth sign who's kind of an idiot. Or you could just be dealing with idiots in general. Hmm. I feel like either something's ended or you're ending it with avoiding this tower. Right? You're trying to go for happiness. Yay! Oh, okay. Wow, this idiot, like, they're looking at your happiness like, you know, it pisses them off. They've just boiled your daughter's rabbit. <laughs> I always say the Queen of Cups in this deck, when she's reversed, she's like Glenn Close from Fatal Attraction. Upright, she's still Glenn Close, but not as crazy. Yeah, I not slept with her yet, but she's fucking nuts. Don't do it, right? Ooh, three cards. Getting what you wished for. Damn. Queen of Wands right here is impatient and ignoring the King of Cups. And that's the counterpart to the Queen of Cups, right? Could be the same person. Um, could be two totally different people. But it's like, uh... Hmm. Someone is ignoring her intuition over this way. Meanwhile, it's like you're getting what you wished for. But it's like, someone's selfish and impatient and they're turning their back to all of it. So it's like, what? What's up with this, um... What's up with these pair? Because, like, I am very confused about them. Capricorn's like, you're dead. Okay, yeah. Final Descent. Congrats to everyone. I don't know if I'm in this group, but, you know. I can only hope. I'm trying to be hopeful anyway. But, yeah, it's like someone's all pissed off because you got your sunshine. If you steal my sunshine, sunshine. If you steal my sunshine. Oh, I ran out of breath. My bad. Not that it made it sound any better or worse. Boop. Ew. What's this? <laughs> oh, okay. Let's see. What? Okay, hold on. Workplace where people can work together. Someone having that coin. But the Five of Cups right here. Something got spilt as well? Hmm. One more. Okay, because I'm just like... Huh. Capricorn, it's almost like you're still feeling like the sadness from shit getting knocked over, but this person who's in red, who's also the Emperor, um, I feel like is giving you something. And ignoring people who already have something. Like, you might still be sad. Like, you have some money. And you're like, I'm sad. And then this person's like, well, here's more coin. Like, stop being sad. And you're like, yay. Because this bitch is also in yellow as well. So there might be things that you're sad about. Things that got knocked over. Things that got ruined. But, like, you know, it looks like some of y'all are going to be making that dollar. And if you aren't making that dollar, someone's going to come in to help you make that dollar. So that's pretty sweet. I have to say, Capricorn, you got a nice shadow. You might not even be knowing this shit's happening around you. Or something's going on. 
either you or a cross watcher whatever it is someone's like traveling to make that coin and they're leaving someone really really unhappy I feel like they can't get along with this Queen of Cups person though not sure why anyway that's the reading for everybody yes it is if you like this or enjoyed it please like share subscribe if that's what you want to do no pressure y'all as always um i will talk to you guys later love you bunches you take it easy now and have a good day bye, -bye.